hi welcome back in our last video we discussed about creating the security keys in this video i'm going to uh, see the token validity so we have to check if the token is valid or not so how to check it this one we have to write it the function public boolean we have to express it is it is true or not validate token validate token here we have to pass the two arguments first is the string so token what's the token is coming after that user details along with the user details right so after that here we have to write final we have to write string username equals we have to write get username from token we have to pass this token After that, we have to write. After that, we have to write. Uh, write return. You have to write username. It's simply you have to write username. Dot equal Java. You have to write equal. Check it from here. This user details. Right? Whether the things are valid or if it is coming from the front end, it is checking here. Right? The username is valid or not from the database. Right, and we have to check the token, and we have to check the token. We have to, write, we have to make it as is token is token token x paired method. We have to create this one. We have to create here as token. We pass this token. That's it. That's the thing. You have to write it. Now we are going to raise here. You have this one. You have to pop, uh, click on this. Click on this. We have to create the method. So to create the method, click on here. It's created here. Right? It will be created here. Don't want to create it here. Okay. When the require is coming to your front end, it's it's first you have to this the user details and token. It will be first you have to check it whether it, it will be username is valid from the database. It is there. And talk and it's expired or not. Right? That's that's the thing you have to write. Okay. So here you have to create here is talk and expire. Here we have to write it. We have to write the date and check it. Final date expiration expire. You have to write expire equal get client from token. We have to type this token token so the token comma climb get expiration so write it over here return expire dot before new date that's it that's the thing you have to write okay you have to set the before date okay before okay you have to check whether the token is expired or not the token date you have to check uh, the token is expired or not we have to check along with the date you have set it okay today that it valid today at, at that time only so you have check it here you have check it the token right so that is a that's the best practice okay we have to validate the token while you validate the token after that you have to write the public string generate generate token User details open and close brackets. They have to write it here map string comma objects 
climb equal new hash map here we have written jwt dot builder you write dot set climb after that second one you have to set subject user details dot get username set issue issue at new date system dot current date yes after the dot dot you have to write set expire state you have to write new date system dot current time and minutes this one that you have to check it now here the expiration date token expiration date you have to write here the token validity is you have to copy this so here plus token validity you have to write you have to write thousand. Right, that's the thing you have to write. After that, you have to write sign in with sign in with sign algorithm. This algorithm is after that comma security key. This security key. This security key. This security key. This security key. That's the thing you have to write. Okay, that's the thing you write. So dot com. That's the thing you write. Okay, this is how we have to generate the token. Here yeah, we have to write the generator token. Right? The, uh, we have to set the date and username here. You, have, you can see here. You have to climb this all the username. Here is your date and expiry date. Okay, these are the things you have to set into the token. Generate the token. Thank you for watching. I will see you in my next lecturing. Thank you for watching.